Good evening, I'm Larry Eisner, and I'm here to present the Robert Eisner Community Service Award. I found. On behalf of myself and my sisters, I would like to thank the Federation for awarding the Robert Eisner Community Service Award again this year, which I believe is the 36th time it has been awarded. The operative word for the award is community, something my father cared deeply about. My father was an immigrant from Poughkeepsie, New York, that is, <laughs> and came to the New Haven area to go to law school. Within a year, he was dating a New Haven girl from the Beaver Hills, and I think it was then that, then and there, that he decided he liked the New Haven community and decided to stay. My father's life in New Haven and at the law school was interrupted by his Navy service in World War II and then law practice in New York City for a few years. But he was back in New Haven permanently by 1950, and as it happens, in time for the groundbreaking ceremony on, January, on June 1st, 1952, of the Chapel Street Jewish Community Center. There's that word again, community. Though I have no idea whether my father attended the groundbreaking. The Chapel Street JCC was an early work of the famed architect Louis Kahn, and was completed in 1954. I have a lot of fun childhood memories from that building. As I mentioned, my father cared deeply about this community. He was a member of numerous committees, president of the JCC, headed the UJA, and was on the board of the Federation. Why so much community activity, community activity and participation? Which is also a question I get asked each of you, too. Maybe part of the answer are in these few lines from Shakespeare's Othello, which I remember my father recited many, many times. Good name in man and woman is the immediate jewel of their souls. He who steals my purse steals trash, but he that filters me from me my good name robs me of that which enriches him not and makes me poor indeed. I believe that what my father was doing with this quote was passing along the idea of giving back and doing well by doing good. And I believe he was also channeling proverb Proverbs 22, which says, A good name is more desirable than great riches. To be esteemed is better than silver or gold. It's, that, it's what the Federation and recipients of this word are about, service to others. Now knowing a bit more about my father, there can be no better tribute to his memory and his commitment to support our community than bestowing this word on deserving, deserving recipients each year. Last year, the Federation was pleased to present the Eisner Award to first responders, community agencies, congregations, and town officials who stepped forward to assist us in the immediate aftermath of the fire and subsequent months displaced from our community building. This year's awardees picked up where our first responders left off. They guided the process of redesign and innovation that led us back to our renewed community home. It is truly my honor to call each of you forward to, to receive the Robert Eisner Community Service Award as members of the Building Steering Committee. Each of your names will be added to the permanent plaque that hangs in our community building. When I call your name, please come forward to receive the award and then remain standing for a group photo. Rabbi Michael Farben, who I understand is not here tonight. Scott Hurwitz. Pat Perkins. <laughs> Stephen Miller. Stacy Perkins. Norman Rapsky.
David Tracton. And Evan Weiner. 